Hi everyone, this is Mrs. Cookie. I welcome you back to my YouTube channel where I do celebrity tarot readings. Please subscribe, like and comment. Also, in case you might be interested in getting a private reading, send me an email and I will give you all the details. And um, today, for all of you fans of the British Royals, this again will be a reading about one of them. It will be about Prince Harry. And we will just check his current energies and what's going on in his life. He turned 40 this um, past month. And um, I thought that, that uh, this would be a great occasion to do a reading on him. I also did a reading on him and his wife and also on his wife separately in the past month. So you may want to check uh, these readings out in my Royals playlist. And um, as I meditated before each reading, I also got some vibes concerning Prince Harry during meditation. And they uh, go together very well with the reading I did recently on Meghan, his wife. For Harry, I see that he will think about emigration and going back to the UK. This is lying deeply on his heart and soul right now. He wants to get back to his roots. He doesn't feel very comfortable in the United States. And um, so we will ask the cards and see if my intuition is right and what the cards have to say. So please, Spirit. Give me one overall message about the current situation of Prince Harry. What is he dealing with in his life right now? <laughs> there you go. I just talked about it. It's the Eight of Cups. Moving on. Abandonment, abandoning plans, walking away, letting go, traveling, escapism, reaching limit, self-analysis, self-discovery disappointment and looking for the truth so again i saw this during meditation and i get the vibes that he's very unhappy and uh, discontent with his situation in the united states right now and he really wants to go someplace else and it's the uk i feel as i told you he did a lot of self um, analysis and he now knows that this escape to the United States wasn't suiting him and he wants to... <sighs> he has overcome his disappointment. He's looking for the truth now. And this man here is turning his back on the situation and looking someplace else. So expect Harry to connect with his royal family in the UK. And he obviously is thinking about going back to his roots. That's what I told you before even pulling this card. So we will see. Please, Spirit, show me this card flipped out immediately. I will keep it. Show me three cards about the future of Prince Harry in the next few months. I need two more cards, Spirit. Okay. The first card that popped up was the Knight of Pentacles, Patience, Perseverance, Unexpected Source of Money, Time Heals Our Wounds, Patient, Trustworthy, Someone Who Perseveres to Reach a Goal. So due to the self-analysis and self-discovery Prince Harry has gone through in the past years, this card tells me that he's looking for a way to um, move forward. And um, this card talks about healing wounds. So obviously he did this and he's still doing this. And he's fo he is focusing on this coin in his hand, which is, in my opinion, when I hold this card, he wants to connect with his father and his brother again and also gain back the reputation he once had in the UK. 
Yeah, that's what I get with this card here. The second card is the strength card. Inner strength, courage, bravery, taming control, overcoming self-doubt, focus, persuasion. So it will take a lot of his courage and bravery and his strength to do this, to move forward to his family in the UK and maybe to admit that he had disappointed them and some things went wrong in the past and expect in the next month to follow that Harry will make a move towards his heritage and towards um, the royals he left behind and he's obviously very um, energetic and self-assured when it comes to making this move even though it takes a lot of his uh, courage so we got the emperor as the third card stability structure protection authority ambition older man stability fatherhood and father figure so this in my opinion is king charles and Harry really, really deep in his heart and soul is now looking for a way to reconnect with his father. And he will do this in the next few months. He will move towards him with probably an offer with this coin here. And he will be very brave making this step towards King Charles, who he had uh, disappointed very much in the past. And... <sighs> He may be also uh, seeing that his father is weakened at, the t at this time, let it say it this way. He's uh, dealing with severe um, health issues, as you all know. And when I hold this card, and I also got that uh, during meditation, I feel Harry doesn't want to lose his father before making amends with him and reconnecting with him and that's what he will do that's his focus in the next weeks and month and as you see he already is in the state of moving and walking away he's letting go of his old life in the united states he's had enough and every time i meditate on him and every time i look at his picture i get the vibes that he regrets being so um, harsh to his dear loved ones he left behind and he will make a move forward now. That's what I see. So I will pull a card from the Sacred Symbols Oracle deck now to see what Spirit also wants to reveal us about Harry's situation right now. Please, Spirit. Show me one clear message. What is Prince Harry dealing with in the next weeks to follow? What are his intentions? Lucky. I will read this out of the book. Although I don't feel it needs any explanation. It's the number 47. You've got the Midas touch. Everything you touch turns to gold at this time. Enjoy this winning stick streak you are on. Meditate on this when you need an extra boost of being in the right place at the right time kind of energy. So spirit gives us a hint that Prince Harry has luck at its side when it comes to making um, a, fresh, a fresh start and a renewal of the... Um, relationship with his father things will turn out in his favor i feel so very strongly and his father and the other royals will be happy that harry will make this move towards them and um, so this is a sign of luck and his journey back to the uk will be um under a good um, circumstance and um, he will be at the right place at the right time as this card says to make um, final decisions about coming back that's what i see 
but I will pull one last card because I want to know about his father, King Charles. Please, angels, show me a card. Will he be open to Harry? Give me a message. We got Prosperity, Archangel Ariel. Your material needs are provided as you follow your int intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So this tells me King Charles will be very happy and glad to have his son back in his arms. He will, he will give him everything necessary uh, for his move back to the United Kingdom, especially he will provide material needs, as this card says. He will be a helpful hand and um, do everything that he can to um, bring back Harry into his old old way of life that's what i feel and um yeah expect him really to make a significant uh, move towards his family and i can see him moving back to to the uh, uk in the next years i'm not sure about megan for some reason as you saw in my um reading i did on her in the past there will be heavy times rushing towards this couple and this person here is alone and I also got that during meditation. I feel Harry will make this move towards his family alone for some reason and maybe um, yeah, leave his wife behind. That's what I get. But um, let's see. Energies can change. I always tell you this. At the moment, his steps are moving in the direction towards his family. That's what this reading showed us. And that's also the vibe I get when I uh, meditate on him. That's the picture spirit shows me as well. Harry alone going back to the UK and um, his father helping him with that. And um, yeah, I'll leave this now. This reading as it is I don't feel it is necessary to speak any longer because spirit gave me clear messages and um, I don't want to waste anybody's time here if the messages are straight and direct I'll stop the reading I'll connect with the royal family as soon as I feel the energies are right for some new readings on them I hope you like this reading please don't forget to comment in the comment section and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so i will always continue to do um, readings on the royals if you click these videos enough and um, all celebrities that are often clicked here on my channel will be a continuation of the readings um, i do in the future so um, yeah I hope you guys also have a lucky day. I wish you all the luck in the world on this day. You will see this reading and um, I hope that you come back to my channel and we will meet again. Goodbye.